The Ganja King! Well, at least he didn't call it Fag Java. is whacked. Just say no one's fussing her. Hey listen, it's not my fault. It's not my fault that uh, I make them wake up and see their manhood. Everybody on my side, I got them sitting with their feet up in the air, just marking the scorecard. Going, that boy told him. He told him four years ago, don't start it. I right, listen. Everybody was well warned. You know, you know, you know what I learned from warnings. Sometimes y'all need to heed them. Okay. 
Well, I'm not going to lie, dude. I don't see them as any fight. So I hope you don't get mad at me for not seeing them as any fight. Uh, you know, I, I, it's not my fault that I did what I know how to do. Excellent to bring out the justified truth and the truth. It's not my fault that the only lying, crackhead, junkie motherfucker out here that got exposed was Mr. Enforcer 250. It's not my fault, dude. I didn't do it to him. His own mouth and his own lips did. And I could not have done it without his own lips. Of course, I threw a lot of psychology in the mix, you know, because that's the way I operate. You know, no one, no, no one went to attack, you know, being able to read voice tremors and uh, 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 heart rate, the king of New York. And believe me, I don't have those four credits and I don't have that job because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm a closer, baby, and I warn them, don't start it. Well, you know, he convinced everybody he was brought a special pair of Kevlar gloves, and he convinced them on numerous occasions what he was gonna, how he was gonna come to Brooklyn, and what he was gonna do while he was in Brooklyn to utilize them. And you know, I, you know, I, I, I'm giving him every opportunity to use his Kevlar's and to provide a justified route. I'm giving him the golden opportunity to show the world out here that I'm his crack smoking buddy and I have his dying disease. I'm enabling him to get it all on camera. He could be a star. I tell you, for the fun of it, for the fun of it, and I told you I wasn't going to get in the middle, but I like to, uh, I like the little CB bullshit. For the fun of it, take a drug, uh, take a drug kit to the key down. If some boys show up, make them piss in the car. Oh, hi, right, listen, I'll be, more to, I'll be more happy to do it. We already know I'm going to go off the chart for weed. But I bet you, I bet you, it rings up nothing else. Well, that's his bad meter, you know, the one that reads a 300 watt dead key and a 600 watt pep for a two pill. But uh, it's just another Saturday, dude. It's a twin final radio, it's a 25 watt radio, and that's that. Yeah, I'll be back. I want to go smoke it out. Oh, and I'm back. Wow. Yeah, You know, it's obvious you don't pay attention to our video gates. We've been squashing him and his two pill for a while now. You really want to know what it looks like without it? Just go to any video gate be before August 13th, and you get to see his bad precarious in either one of our gates. I'm out, man. I'm going to roast this out. Oh, I'm sorry. That was to the people who might pay attention. I'm out. Okay, talk about me all you want. I'm going into the next room. I don't want my uh, I don't want my power supply in my amp breathing my smoke. A two o six. Two o six. Alright, Roger on that. Yeah, I'm looking. A two o six. We here. A two o six, Britt. Uh, yeah, come on. Who is that? It's triple five. Look. 
I remember that you said you had a talk show out here a long time. I remember you since Rogue Master, 111, Batman, um, even that dude used to be out there called the so Sweet Dick Willie. I, I, I remember you for a long time. Yeah, you had a talk show out there a long time. That's what I met y'all during that talk show. Something like that. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I know, I know. But I'm uh, talking to you on the radio. It's been a long time, big brother. And listen, listen. You know what I do, man? You, you, you talking to me, uh,